Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to the channel. In this video, I will walk you through how to use Active Track in 2025, which is a top rated employee productivity and behavior analytics tool. So, whether you are managing a remote team, running a hybrid office, or just trying to boost the workplace efficiency, Active Track actually helps you to track how time is spent, identify the productivity trends, and improve the focus all while respecting your employees' privacy. We will go through step by step on how you can set it up, monitor the activity, use the productivity dashboards and set up the alerts. We will also walk you through how you can get the most out of its powerful analytics. So make sure that you watch this video till the very end so that you don't miss any of the important steps here. All the helpful links including the link of active track is given down in the description box below. That is my affiliate link. If you use that link in order to activate your free trial over here, you will also access the demo account plus you will get the 14 day free trial exclusively with that link. So without further delay, let's get straight into it. So in the first step, we will start by creating our account at activetrack.com. For that, you can either click on the link that is given in the description or you can open your web browser and search for activetrack.com. Now, once you are on this page, simply click on the get started for free option in the top right hand corner of the screen. Over here, you can sign up with the help of your Google account or you need to fill out this form. Now, here is one thing that you need to remember. You cannot actually create your account on active track with the help of your email address or your microsoft or google account you will have to have a business account here so in order to create your business email i would recommend you to use proton.me it is very easy for you to do you need to come at proton.me and simply create your business email over here so this is the business email that i have created on proton me and i have used this particular email in order to create my uh, active track account so you need to provide your first name your last name your phone number select your organization here in this business email you need to paste this proton.me email after that provide your password and select your country then after clicking on this option simply click on the sign up option once done you will have to follow further on screen instructions like uh, selecting some of the useful steps and you will be redirected in your dashboard so your active track admin dashboard should look something like this where you can basically start setting up your workplace now in the step two you need to basically install the tracking agent on each of the user's computer this thing can be done with the help of sending them the invitation link to your team or manually downloading the agent on their machine that works on windows mac os and uh, chrome os so once it is installed the agent can run uh, silently in the background and starts collecting the activity data like uh, app usage website visits active or idle time mouse or keyboard activity it does not actually record any screens or keystrokes by default uh, which helps maintain employee trust so here in the left hand section you will see the team pulse where you will see all of your team members and all of the users you can click on this refresh page and you can keep on refreshing it so that you could get the latest information about it so as i said earlier you need to download the agent in each of your employees system and then it will start working now we will just explore uh, further details that is available on this dashboard so on your admin dashboard first of all you need to hover over to the left hand section and click on live reports here in live reports you will see the real time insights like uh, who is online and what apps are in use whether the user is active or idle uh, you will also get the information about the team like um, the team the department or individual employees so each user timeline shows productive versus unproductive time so you can click on the productivity option and uh, session breakdowns and also the break durations so you can also set the custom working hours or activity thresholds to tailor it to your team's schedule so you can do this by uh, using the live report option and just using these options that are given over here now if we talk about the productivity 
potatoes and further insights option here so you will see uh, click on the insights option so in the insights option you will see the activity classification so here um, you can basically label the websites or the applications uh, like productive unproductive or neutral so active track basically uses ai to help you auto classify the common tools based on the roles so marketing tools might be productive or one team but uh, not for another so this classifications actually power your productivity store which shows how focused your team uh, uh, are over the time you can also use the insight feature for further usage like uh, selecting the uh, focus time versus multitasking uh, you will also see the workload balance distraction patterns um, in the workload balance you will see who is overworked and underutilized so these tools are great for understanding your team's habits and uh, planning more effective work schedules it also helps with the burnout prevention since you can support the teams working long hours without any break now we need to just understand the alarms and the uh, reports so here you need to hover over to the left hand section and click on alarms so once you click on alarm uh, you will see the daily weekly and custom date range so you can filter it out with the help of the app usage website visits or ideal time you can also set up the real time alerts for the events like uh, use of the band app or login during the off hours so you can do that by using this option so this option is great for both security monitoring and identifying the possible uh, productivity leaks now in active track you will also see the mobile access and integrations so you can actually integrate active track with google workspace with slack or azure active directory hr system and yes there is a mobile version of the dashboard so managers can also monitor on the go for advanced users you will also see the api integrations option so api and power bi connectors are also available here for custom analytics and dashboard so that's how you can start using active track in 2025 from uh, setting up to the productivity analytics to team insights it is quite great tool for helping the teams work smarter not harder while giving managers uh, clear visibility without uh, spying on them uh, if so if this tutorial helped you out give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button and also comment below with your questions and tools you would like to see next thanks for watching this video and i will see you in the next one